The European Union faces many geopolitical challenges in the current time period, probably more than at any time in its whole history. And I'll just mention three really important ones. The first one, and of course top of mind right now and into the future, is the war in Ukraine and relations with Russia. And this is such a geopolitical challenge because one of the main goals of European integration was to prevent a war in Europe. Now, the, the base of this, this issue is really its relations with Russia. And as we think to the future, we think at some point this war will end. We don't know how it will end. We don't know when it will end. And it probably won't be really very soon. But once the war does end, Russia will still remain a, a very important geopolitical issue for the EU because the European Union will have to try to figure out how to regulate its relationship with a, with a country that's actually a neighbor and will be there you know, for, for the long, forever, really, as a neighbor of the EU, and how to bring that relationship into some kind of normal or stable condition. A second area of challenge relates to other rising powers. And particularly important here is China. The European Union has a very strong and developed relationship with China in terms of trade and investment. But China, like Russia, is also an authoritarian government. And so this poses many challenges for the EU in, in terms of how to balance the exercise of its normative power, in other words, its efforts to export certain values relating to human rights and governance, with its economic interests in terms of its very strong relationship with China in that arena. A third area of geopolitical challenge relates to the Middle East. And here, again, there are a number of authoritarian governments and potentially unstable regions or regions that are currently unstable. And here, of course, this can lead, as it did a few years ago, to massive migration flows. Migration flows may not only come from that region, also from North Africa, and as we see climate change intensifying, we may have climate change related migration flows to Europe as well. So there's a number of specific geopolitical challenges that the EU faces, but underlying all of these and affecting the capacity of the EU to really address them effectively is the issue of whether the EU can maintain a unified position and forge a kind of strategy that's not simply short term, but in, involves a vision of how these kinds of difficult geopolitical challenges can be handled.